Well, hello my friends and welcome to my mess. Check this out. This is how my planner kind of has been looking recently. I know it's been a hot minute since I've done a plan with me. We're gonna talk about the plan with me's and why I'm not doing them as often in just a moment, but I'm gonna get started right away because I don't want to have this video be any longer than it needs to be because this is probably gonna be a long one, so you might wanna like grab a snack or something. Recently, well actually not recently, this has been going on for a while. Oh, I'm gonna say all the um, washies that I'm using are currently in my shop if you wanna check them out. Even though I'm using full rolls of some things, the, the little ones are in my shop. So, um, there have been a few situations that have given me some pause, and this is not like, oh, feel bad for me kind of a thing. This is just me being real with y'all as to like looking at my life and my channel just a little bit differently and not in a bad way, but it's like, I feel like it's a good thing to like reassess, you know, where you're going and like what's important to you and all that good stuff. I think I'm just going to have to do this like this, <laughs> but so some of the things that have happened and if you're watching and one of you have said this in the past. Don't feel bad. This is just like my own personal like thoughts and opinions. In the past when I used to do plan with me is all the time. I never really gave you guys like a good reason why I kind of stopped. And there was several reasons, but this was one of them as to safety. I've had a few instances where I have shown like hey, this Saturday I'm gonna be at like Ikea or Mall of America or like somewhere public. No one's ever like approached my door, thank goodness, or anything like that. So I'm not like worried about that situation, but I'm just at a place right now that I don't really wanna share where I'm going and what I'm doing prior to then. And um, actually I had a great conversation with some of the gals at the planner meetup that happened this past weekend, um, which was right here, but it's already the next week, which I'm not gonna show you yet because maybe I'll do a plan with me next week, you never know. But, you know, I was asking them, I'm like, well, you know, what do you guys think? You know, like they obviously know me in like real life. So I was like, do you think that people would still even like wanna see a plan with me even though it's like after the fact and they're like, oh yeah, I would wanna see it even if it's like plans you already did. Like I totally understand like, you know, safety and like all that stuff. I'm like, okay, well maybe I'll film a video and like just chat about it initially. So like then you guys know moving forward that it's not gonna be the current week that we're in. It's gonna be like the week before or maybe even two weeks before or something like that. It's never gonna be current anymore. But I hope you guys understand that and like my reasoning for it. You know, nothing like horrible has ever like happened to me or anything like that. But I'm just trying to prevent like certain situations from happening if that makes any sense to y'all. But if you guys wanna catch up with me on like a more regular basis and like kinda know what's going on and like all that good stuff, um, feel free to follow me on like Instagram and Facebook. That's kind of where all of my real time stuff happens. So like whatever I'm willing to share, I'm sharing it there. So I've got these Chrissy and Design stickers and I'm gonna be putting in my videos and I've been posting a lot more videos lately because I feel like I've been like more into YouTube. So I'm really, really enjoying that. So I'm gonna just write all those and put those in. I'm using like a ton of these and my main colors that I'm using for this spread are going to be red, blue, and yellow if you can't like tell by all of this good stuff. So the videos that I post in the morning, I actually have them pre-scheduled and I have them scheduled at 6 a.m. Um, and I just kind of like that. I don't know, I feel like that just works for me. Um, I actually filmed a grocery haul too and I put up a grocery haul as well this day. So let's, I don't know, should we put two on top of each other? Yeah, let's just do two right on top of each other because I think that's fine. Even though I posted the grocery haul like later in the day and then I did my, I think it was, I'm pretty sure this was my Alaska 
plan with me. That happened on this the past Tuesday. And then Wednesday was what, the Dollar Tree haul, which I love me some Dollar Tree stuff. And you guys asked me some really good questions in the comments and I've tried to answer all of them as to like, you know, if I like certain things and you guys have given me like awesome feedback on like certain items that you really like from the Dollar Tree. So that's pretty sweet. And then let's see, did a recipe tracker. Um, the recipe tracker that I did, if y'all are interested, it's clearly on my channel, but I took inspiration from Ryan over at A Man With The Plans on YouTube. And um, he did one for himself and I was like, oh my gosh, I definitely need that in my life. So I kind of made it my own, but clearly credited him in my video because he just had an awesome idea. And I am like so stuck in a rut of like what I'm eating. It's just like so boring y'all. Like I, ugh. I don't know. I'm just uninspired, I think is my problem. So that is what's going on there. And actually at my event the other day, I got these boxes. These were in my like in the D stash table and I was like, I really want this. So I'm gonna use this little guy right here, the yellow one for my film and edit. And I'm gonna use this little sheet I just got from a Coffee Break Planner and it's got like little edit guy on there which i think is super cute so i'm gonna use this one here all right so that's kind of what i did in the morning slash afternoon kind of line this up right okay perfect all right next up i edited my resume use this little icon from chrissy and designs i'm gonna be using a lot of things from chrissy and designs because it's just right here and i've got my little binder out and I don't really feel like getting out the rest of my stickers at the moment. So, you know, that happens sometimes. Every time I write resume, I feel like I'm doing it wrong. Like resume, it's not resume, it's resume, but you know, whatever. <laughs> All right, and then I'm gonna use this little yellow um, computer guy to put in my emails. Let's see, I had two emails and I'm gonna do this other little thing. Hold on here. So I'm gonna use these and I'm gonna try to be brave and use them without a tweezers. And they're like the little checklist, but they're like <laughs> not uh, on a strip or anything. So that can sometimes be scary, but I'm trying to use the little lines to like line them up properly. Okay, perfect. All right, so let me write emails. And then I had to email Amanda and Tori. And I did those things, so we're gonna be super satisfying and check them off that list, girl. Okay, perfect. And then um, I watched my friends over at Coffee Break Planner and, oh wow, there's something stuck to my binder, okay. I. Watched my friends over at Coffee Break Planner with their live. I try to watch their lives as much as I can. And I have a fun video coming up soon featuring some of their products. So kind of pumped about that. And uh, let's see here. I am going to use this sheet right here. And then I also want to grab, I'm gonna use this one as well. So I'll put in there live. And then these are super cute. It's got like a bunch of planners and then a little mug that says CBP with some pen sticking out. So I think that is like extra, extra freaking cute. And I will use, let's see here. I'm gonna use a blue one because I've got kind of red going on in this. So put this right at the end of the day because they have their, lives um, kind of at the end of the day and they're usually uh, on Mondays. But if you guys are interested in um, joining their Facebook group, you can just search their Facebook group and I'll leave, try to remember to leave a link down below for y'all. So basically for the majority of the day on Tuesday, I did some stuff, which I will talk about in just a moment here. Let me just write this down. I have been doing some contracting with a gal through my social media company that has been going pretty well. I have been working for this company and I'll, I think it's okay to share the name of it. It's called You Crafty. 
And they are based out of Isanti, Minnesota. And this gal does these workshops. It's like a DIY workshop. So it's like all the stuff that you kind of see on Pinterest and all that stuff. But um, I have been creating some unique content for her. So, you know, to kind of help with her social media following and things like that. So if you guys are in Minnesota and you want to, you know, check out what this is all about. I will leave the links below. Um, it's fairly new in the social media game. It's fairly new, but she's been doing this for a little while. Yeah, so it's it's a really cool place to go. It's like a B, like they don't have like beer or wine there, but it's like a BYOB kind of a situation. So you can like bring some wine or bring a beer or whatever and like craft with your friends and like bring your friends to sign up. It's like five bucks to like hold your space, but you can usually pick from any craft that's on the menu for the most part. And she's doing this new thing now where like once a month she's doing these like kitty crafts and she's really been loving that. So that's been kind of a cool little thing that I have been helping her with. So um, yeah, youcrafty.com, that's, that's who she is. All right, I do have specific stickers for these closet situations. So let me do that. Okay, and I'm gonna use these, this little sheet from Christian Designs. It has like the stitched around the outside. And did you guys know that this was one of the first sheets I ever got from Christian Designs? Back when she only like restocked once in a great while. And then when she did, she like sold out right away. So um, yeah, this is what I am going to use. And it's KAD00484. So um, I worked on cleaning out my master closet and reorganizing the whole thing. And I will be showing a after tour once it's all done. It's not done yet. It'll be done, it'll be done fairly soon, I think. So like within the next month or so, I think it's gonna be done because I'm, I'm working on some things. But I am going to use the blue. Oh, blue on blue looks really weird. <laughs> oh well, all right, come on, there we go. That took a moment. And then, um, these stickers say declutter on them and then it's got like a closet that's just like booming out. I actually tried to look up this gal for my plan with me and unfortunately she's no longer in business but um, if you guys search like closet clean out or declutter this um, image might be out there. I don't, I don't know but anyway but that's what I did for this day. And this little declutter that I'm gonna put right over here, master closet, because I just kind of open up everything and have a good time and <laughs> just Doyle sits on the bed and then judges me. It's really great, y'all, it's really great. All right, and that evening I edited, so I'm just gonna put my little edit icon down here. I don't really even remember what video I edited, but that's okay, we can just, over there okay perfect and then my mom and aunt came over for a little while i actually filmed with my mom and that video will be up this week which will be awesome and um yeah they came over i don't even remember when they came over but i'm just gonna put some hours in but my aunt was here my aunt was not in the video but she was over here as well and um we filmed an honest review of princess cruise lines i know a lot of you have been asking about my cruise and if i would give like you know a review about you know, my, like our experience and stuff. I thought it was like really important for my mom to be in that video just because clearly she was like a part of the whole thing. So I felt like that was really important. So anyway, she's in the video. All right, I'm gonna use one of these little house stickers from, oh my gosh, I can't talk. Uh, <laughs> Coffee break planner. I'm gonna put this right over here. I don't know why I'm doing it on my fingers. I'm just strange today. All right, and I'm not gonna use this full thing. I wanna use like a little, I don't know, use it as like a little event sticker kind of, but I'll use the rest of it probably later on in this spread. There we go. Like I don't need it for the full time, you know? All right, so they're in, and then filmed with the favorite mama, so let's put that in. So, I did a little filming with the mother right there, and then, okay, are we still in the frame? Yes, we are, cool. All right, so I did a whole bunch more things. On Thursday, I did more work in the master closet, so I'm gonna put that in again. I didn't do as much work that day, to be honest, but 
it was still work. So there we go on that. And then I think I'm gonna use a yellow one for this one. All right, and then I had a phone interview. Whoops, here we go. <laughs> Can't do anything today. Um, I had a phone interview on Thursday. All right, and that was at three o'clock. And then before that, I did some interview prep because I crept on the company, which is probably a good thing. <laughs> so I'm gonna use one of these pencils again. Put that right here. So I like prepped all my questions I had for them and you know, all that good stuff because it's good to, you know, know what you're getting into. And um, clearly I'm not ready to like talk about it yet, but if things go well, which hopefully they do, um, I will be doing some sort of video at some point. And then, all right, I also did a few other things that day. I finally put my stupid car tags on my car, so that's helpful. Like That took way longer than I ever thought. I've had them, but to be honest, I don't really like drive my car that often, and like clearly I should, but I don't. <laughs> so anyway, it's just whoopsie dips, right guys? So I was like, I better actually put those dang things on my vehicle. So yeah, oh gosh. I have like this whole mess going on off camera for y'all. Anyway, and then I ran to the grocery store this day as well. I think that we are good with that. Okay, I had a meeting with the gal that I am helping with her business and I'm pretty sure it was at 10. No, it was at nine, I'm a liar, okay. There we go, perfect. I just think that these are really cute, so I'm gonna put a little like asterisk right there. All right, so that worked out. And then also she came over and looked at a piece of furniture that she's going to be buying from me. So that's exciting. All right, so I'm gonna put in this for furniture because she came over and we looked at some things. I'm gonna put in one of these little house icons because she came over and it was good times. Keep that over there. Awesome, all right, so then I did a few other things. So my dad and I went out to Subway because that's like one of his lunch places of choice. All right, so I went to Subway with the favorite father and Ooh, I'm gonna keep this out because I need that for something else. And then after that, I actually went to um, a thrift shop and I'm gonna be sharing with you guys later, like not now, <laughs> clearly, but later, how I utilized one of the items that I got. So that was kind of exciting. And it's something for the house, so just FYI. And the funny thing is, is I only got one thing the whole time I was out thrift shopping, so. But sometimes it just works out that way. You don't find everything you want, so that's all right. And then I took a nap that day. <laughs> and I took a nap that day because I was so tired and I didn't really know why. I'm gonna use um, one of these yellow stickers from Plan to Plan Sticker Co. I don't think it was at five o'clock, but I did take a nap that day and it felt amazing, let me tell you. It felt real good. But then of course I was like up all night, so that's like my own my own personal dilemma. So the next day we had all the fun. I am gonna put in a few things right away. I'm actually gonna put down some things at the bottom and then I'm gonna kinda just like fill this guy up. All right, so at the very end of my night, I dropped off bags to my mom. My pal Jade is like, the best and she collects bags for my mom. My mom makes these mats for the homeless in Florida and my mom's here right now in Minnesota, but she like, she cuts them into strips and she makes what they call Plarn, P-L-A-R-N. If y'all are interested in how to do this, there's tons of videos on the internet and no, my mom's not gonna make one. I've already asked her like several times and she's like, no, I can't do that. So 
sorry, she ain't gonna do it. So anyways, my, um, my friend Jade brought a ton of bags and I was like, I do not want all those things in my house. Like I am gonna go drop those off because I do not need to do that. So anyway, thank you Jade if you're watching. And um, all right, so I'm gonna fill in the bottom part first. So we went to Sephora, my friend Kate and I went to Sephora and I bought, what did I buy? Origins. Um, if, if I haven't posted it already or linked it already, I will put in the um, Great Minnesota Plan Together like that day I did a little vlog. So if you guys want to see it, but we did go to the Green Mill, which was extra awesome. That down over here. All right, and that was about right there. And I'm pretty sure that I have some sort of Sephora icon somewhere. Let me see if I do. All right. I have searched my collection. I do not have a Sephora icon any longer. I don't know where it went. Oh well. Anyway, I'm gonna use these little like cool shopping bags. I'll just use red. Cause isn't Sephora like black and white? Don't they have like a little bit of red in their logo or something or like their staff outfits? Aren't they like black and white and have like a little red? I don't know. Maybe I'm just thinking of Target cause I'm like kind of obsessed with Target. Um, if you guys are interested in these, um, I got these from Lily Henry quite a while ago. So um, I will link their shop below as well. I always try to link as much stuff as I can below. And I went to Sephora and then drove home, drop off bags. All right, cool. Now the fun part, not that this isn't all fun, but okay, I'm gonna pull out a few different things. I'm not sure if I'm gonna use everything, but again, I will always try to link as many things as I can. Well, first before we do this, let's do Sunday because basically I just filmed. So I'm gonna use one of these. I don't know where I got this. This is a long, long time ago. Basically I filmed all the things I edited and I will put in one of these little guys from Piper Paper Company. Just gonna write edit. Okay, and now my battery's flashing, so I'll be right back. All right, sorry if the orientation just changed. I had to switch out my battery because it was dying, so yeah. The fun part of it all, we are gonna be planning out this Saturday, August 11th, and that was the Great Minnesota plan together. So I was pumped about that. And I'm just gonna like cover up the times because the times kind of are irrelevant for what I'm using it for. Even though I did film in the green mill, I'm just not gonna put this here. You'll, you'll see what I'm doing in a second. Like you would think that I don't struggle with washi, but I do because I put this at like the weirdest angle for myself. <laughs> Oh my gosh. <laughs> I literally had to go up like less than a millimeter and it's like, oh, it just snaps just fine. I, it's like user error for sure, y'all. So I'm going to use one of these little cameras from Adriana Piper. It's this cute little black camera that I just absolutely love. And I'm gonna use the yellow one and write vlog. And I don't know why I capitalize vlog. I always do, I'm just weird. I don't capitalize really anything else, but you know, sometimes you just do weird things. <laughs> All right, so let's put in, whoops, vlog. So that is in there. So we had to be there at like 1230. So let me put in a little clock. All right. So I just wrote, leave it 1130 just because the event didn't start till one, but check-in was at like 1230 to one. So I figured, you know, put that in and then I'll like decorate all the fun things. All right. So we had a awesome time at the great Minnesota plan together. It is one of the paid for events that the Minnesota planner addicts put on every year. I will leave down below the Facebook page if y'all are interested in coming. And we got this awesome sheet from Coffee Break Planner there. And it's like their little fair deco sheet, which is awesome. So I'm gonna use some of these in here. And then I have this other sheet that I got at Planertopia or from Planertopia. And this is something I purchased a while ago, but I actually found this shop through some of the swag that was donated maybe like last 
summer's event, I wanna say. So Planertopia was a new shop to me at that point and I've bought a lot of stuff from her. Um, and if you guys are ever interested in donating swag, I am not somebody that actually plans out these events, but if you check out the Minnesota Planner Addicts on Facebook, um, you should be able to chat with an admin on Facebook and like, how to promote your products and things like that. If that's something that you're interested in. I don't want it to be like a big commercial, but that is part of the event and that is awesome. And that's really how I discover a lot of new shops. Like I don't really venture out and do a lot of things. Like I really should, <laughs> but I feel like I find a lot of new shops because there's just so much variety of stuff and so many new places and you get to like touch it and feel it and go, oh yeah, I like that. And speaking of, I'm gonna use this last half box right now and this makes me so happy and satisfied like you don't even know it gives me all the feels guys it gives me all the feels and the reason that they called it the great minnesota plan together is that oh this is so satisfying that the state fair is called the great minnesota get together so it's kind of like a little play on words if you will so that was really fun and then i'm gonna put in let's see here we'll go with the red planner even though at the event we didn't do any planning but that's okay we did a bunch of other things we'll do a little thing there and maybe we'll put in some yellow accoutrements so much cuteness y'all so much cuteness and we'll put in like the the little blue washi tape down at the bottom. So freaking cute. And then um, we did have some really, really awesome cotton candy. So I'm gonna put that in kind of at the top. I just love like, I don't know, I'm more of a functional planner, but like I want it to be functional, but yet I kind of want to like decorate it and like zhuzh it up a little bit, you know? So yeah, and then we actually had some games, which was really, really fun. So I'm gonna put, um, Let's see, I'm gonna put this little like treat stand thing kind of like, oh, maybe like at the bottom here and maybe put like the little Ferris wheel to, I don't know, like maybe, I don't know, right there. And ooh, let's put this little tilt-a-whirl thing. Cause yeah, we did lots of fun, fun games. Ooh, and I'm gonna put in one of these pops too. I'm like gonna use all the stickers because you know, well, why wouldn't you just use all the stickers, right? Okay. Uh, oh, that just looks funny. Okay, hold on, I'm gonna put this down here. Mm, okay, hold on. My little pop, it's like, it looks funny. Or is it like a caramel apple? I don't really know what that is. Okay, let's put this right down here. And then, okay, this looks better. All right, I like that better. <laughs> I was like, I was losing it for a moment. All right, so now that Saturday is done, I think. Um, Sunday was kind of a lazy day, even though I did film a bunch of things. So I'm gonna put in this little like lazy day sticker from Chrissy and Designs. And then I'm gonna put this little blue one in that says planner friends make the best friends because it is so true. So, so true. Okay, and then I think I just like edited for the rest of the day there. I don't think I did much else besides that because it was, it was a lot guys, it was a lot. And I had to, I edited my um, vlog from right here and you know, put that in. I think it was on Monday that that actually posted. All right, so that is it for the plan with me from Monday, August 6th through Sunday, August 12th. If y'all have any questions about anything, feel free to put them down below. Also, let me know your thoughts if you guys enjoy seeing like back planning basically, because then I have more to show you and I can actually talk to you about my week as well. Sorry, this one was kind of a long one. There was a lot of stuff going on and I just wanted to be really thorough and chat with you guys. I know I'm probably gonna have a lot of questions about the interview situation and I will chat with you guys about that if it comes to fruition. If it doesn't, that just means I didn't get the position and that's okay. But clearly I don't wanna show these things before they happen because of privacy and all that good stuff. So anyway, that's gonna be it for me today. Thank you guys so much for hanging out with me for a part of your day. If you like it, make sure to give it a thumbs up. If you like plan with me videos and all things planner related and non-planner related, feel free to subscribe to my channel and uh, you can hit the little red bell notifications. I know some people have unfortunately been unsubscribed recently, so make sure that the subscribe button is not red. So if it's red, that means you're not subscribed and you don't see it in your feed. And also if you hit the bell, that just lets you know when I post a new video. So thanks for hanging out and I will see y'all in the next one. Bye guys!
Well, folks, it's time to kick it old school. Uh, so you can feel cool. <laughs> Give it to me, baby. <laughs> baby. <laughs> yeah. 